Alright guys, today uh, we're going to be making a video on the uh, Bama SCT tuner. I got this. Uh, it's used. It's from my friend. Uh, he also has a YouTube channel if you want to look him up, Joseph Pate. But uh, that's where I got the black car from. And this actually came from the black car, but we married it to my blue car now. So I'm going to keep it with that one. And we'll get a different one for the black one because we're going to need one for that too. But I'm not too sure how to use this. We did some stuff when we married it. He helped me. And hopefully he can either help me or I could figure it out how to get a uh, custom tune uh, for everything that's done to the blue car. But that's later on in the year. I'll do that. And maybe we'll even get a dyno tune just to see where it runs. It'll probably only be like 230, 270 in between there somewhere. But uh, yeah, so I, I pretty much got everything hooked up in the car. We're going to go hook it up. I'll show you guys what it looks like in there. And it uh, has a little window mount and all that good stuff. And then we're going to put the Mustang in the garage. But I just wanted to show this off. Nothing new. You guys probably seen these before. Everybody gets them for their cars. Uh, but just figured I'd make a video on it. So let's get outside. Okay, right, so uh, I'm just going to move the car back in. I'll show you where the tune is going to go real fast, though. And then we'll get it put in inside the garage. It's going to get put up right here. Uh, I got a thing around here somewhere. But this also, uh, that's what it plugs into. So I'm going to move this, back this into the garage. And uh, we'll start doing all that. Next video on this car at some point in time, we're going to fix the exhaust rattle. If you guys want to hear that real fast, you'll see it in that video too, but it's pretty bad. So this is the uh, sticky mount I was talking about. It just uh, sticks to the window. It's pretty strong. Like I don't think it's going to go anywhere. And then it has two clips like that. I'm sure you guys have seen this stuff before. And then there's two slots in the back. And uh, if I get it the right way, it just slides on there. Just like that. So uh, I'm going to get the cord ran up under the dash. Come through here. Maybe one day I'll take the dash apart and put it all in it. But I'm just going to hide it through here and plug it in for now. It should work out pretty good like that. So let me get plugged in. We'll get it turned on. And uh, I'll show you guys what the settings look like. So as you can see, it's not really in the way at all. The wire, that's really, all, really only going to be able to see it. But uh, tucked up under the dash here. Maybe I can run it in between the uh, dash if I take it apart a little bit one day. But yeah, I like it. Uh, I think I can leave it plugged in. We'll find out the battery dies whatnot. It says programmed vehicle, which I don't want to mess with that right now. Gauges and stuff. It says uh, turn key forward. Let me do this real fast and uh, see if we can look at the gauges. So that's really cool. It has uh, speed, RPM, uh, coolant temp. Sorry for the Denon. One sec, I'll let that go away. We got uh, intake temp, coolant temp, like I said, spark and fuel. I don't know why it's shown 10, if that's normal or not. But uh, there's other things you can get in there, I'm pretty sure, if I mess with it more. Let's start it up and see what the IPMs say. That's pretty cool. So it'll uh, let you read the IPMs. The intake temp actually went down after I uh, started it. Let me know if that spikes normal and that feels normal. I don't know if that's normal or not. But that's pretty cool. So yeah, I'm going to keep it just like that. Uh, here soon, I'll show you. I'll make a video of me. Uh, I don't know what that means yet. Uh, so it must just be that I'm shutting it off or something. I forgot how to shut it off. But uh, here soon I'll make a video of me getting like a custom tune on it for like the BBK intake, the quarter intake, the long tube headers, and uh, EGR delete, all that stuff. So we can uh, put that into the car and see how much better it runs. But if you like this small little video, please like, comment, subscribe. we got plenty of more content coming definitely in the summer. Uh, Black Mustang over there. we got the engine out of it and all that good stuff. I don't know when you guys will see that, but I did make videos of that. Uh, pulling the engine out and pulling the uh, old engine apart 
we got to uh, get it back together and everything like that. So uh, I don't know if I'm going to go stage two or stage three cams yet. I'm kind of undecisive right now. I think that's a good word for it. I don't know. But we're going with one of them. It's definitely getting cam, so should sound pretty good. And we'll get a different kind of tuner. I don't know if I'll get the same one. Maybe we'll try a different one so we can make videos on that one and test it out. Show comparison. So uh, if you like these videos, please like, comment, subscribe, share. Hit that thumbs up button. See you guys for the next one.